November is Native American Heritage Month. The first American Indian Day was celebrated in May 1916 in New York. Red Fox James, a Blackfoot Indian, rode horseback from state to state, getting endorsements from 24 state governments to have a day to honor American Indians. Beginning in 1986, Congress requested of President Reagan that the week of November 22nd to 30th be declared American Indian Week. Since this time, each consecutive president has issued proclamations annually to pay tribute to the rich history and urge the public to learn more about Native American cultures. However, much of the Native cultural heritage has been lost. The U.S. policy of Indian removal fragmented whole tribes and nations, placing them in lands with little agricultural value and forcing them to assimilate. Native Americans originally migrated from Asia into Alaska using the Bering Land Bridge and covered the entire North American continent as early as 10,000 BC. The federal government recognizes 562 Indian nations, known as tribes, nations, bands, pueblos, communities, rancheras, and native villages in the United States. Today's Native American population in the U.S. is 5.2 million. Back in the 1400s, at the time of European exploration, the native population used to be over 10 million. A fun and simple way to celebrate Native American Indian Heritage Month is by attending a lacrosse game. You can also try a Native American meal of roasted duck in traditional soup, or some granola and pumpkin bread for a snack. Remember, our nation was founded on the exchange of ideas and mix of Native and Western cultures. That's one of the reasons we have Thanksgiving.